Hi friends, welcome back. So in this video, I will be discussing about user acceptance testing challenges. Whenever you are trying to perform user acceptance testing, what are the various challenges we might be facing that I am going to discuss in this video. There are 10 issues which I am going to discuss in this video. User acceptance testing is a crucial phase of software development, which is very important kind of testing normally, which is done by end user in order to verify the whatever the software which is implemented that will be getting verified whether it meets the requirements and functionalities are working properly or not in a real world scenarios that is all about user acceptance testing that is done by the end user now during this process he might be facing lot of challenges that I am going to discuss. I am going to discuss around 10 challenges. The first challenge uh, we would be facing is undefined requirement. Sometimes what happens the requirements are not very clear and it is also not detailed that can lead to confusion during user acceptance testing for the end user and user may not know what to expect or what constitute a successful testing that is also a big challenge because end users may not be a uh, expert in testing and uh, you may not know what to expect or when we say it is successful that is also a big challenge uh, while doing UIT and the second one is uh, the miscommunication the miscommunication between the developers testers users can lead to a misunderstanding about the expected functionality and the expected behavior of the software. The third one is limited resources. Especially this problem comes when the application is very huge. When the application is very huge, having three, four uh, end users uh, for testing the application with a limited time or with a limited human resource or even limited in the infrastructure it could be your mobile devices or it could be browsers or hardware configuration by implementing or by testing across different combination is very impossible for three four resources that is a big challenge and the next one is scope creep is another challenge where requirements are getting changed more often or more frequently or even additional features getting added into the software that can impact the UAT or it can abruptly uh, stop UAT or it can start the UAT and that is going to delay the overall uh, the project completion. And the next one is the subjectivity of our testing especially on the UAT where users may have different interpretation of the requirements. Each person can have different uh, interpretation for a given requirement. Now that requires proper clarity and that requires to be clearly defined the expected results. Otherwise, each end users may execute in a different way and uh, that may lead to a bigger challenges uh, while performing UAT. The next one is regression testing is another challenge as we testing on UAT a new features or fixes uh, are there then um, because of lack of users there could happen that regression uh, is another challenge where uh, the end users limitation they may not be able to do a complete regression testing uh, because of that uh, it may leads to a bigger challenges especially as I said earlier if it is large and complex applications without doing regression during UIT is a big challenge and the next one is data availability this is one of the biggest challenges in software testing area even that is same applicable for UIT as well during UIT we have to simulate the real world data sometimes this real world data is Availability with the UAT team or end users also a big challenge and we have to simulate the similar kind of uh, test data and we have to see how the application is going to behave with the available uh, simulated data is also a big uh, challenge because of uh, getting production data which is having sensitive information is a big challenge and the next one is environment setup is also another big challenge especially we need to simulate an hardware software configuration which is more similar to the production like environment 
that is a motto of any testing if you are not able to simulate with a similar kind of environment it could be hardware software network configuration can lead to unexpected behavior whenever we are performing uat and the next challenge would be a training needs training needs for the uat professionals or uat end users users may lack of necessary training to effectively conduct uat leading to incomplete testing or inaccurate feedback and the next one is acceptance criteria itself is having a dispute which is not agreed uh, acceptance criteria then that becomes a another big challenge because whenever we are starting with uat we have to clearly define what is entry criteria and what is exit criteria if you are not defining the entry and exit criteria then that leads to a big dispute whenever we are performing both functional as well as performance uh, testing that is the key uh, hence it is always advisable to define criteria well in advance and discuss with the, all the stakeholders get a buy in so that everybody will be in the same page so these are the some of the challenges which we normally face whenever we are trying to perform user acceptance testing